Hey, YouTubers. Well, I've just been to a very incredible two-day fair conference and uh, where I got to hear some really remarkable information. I, I wish all of you guys could show up to this thing. Uh, I'd like to meet all of you as far as that goes. Uh, I think three-fourths of my fun is uh, getting back with old friends and making new friends and meeting friends that I've known on the Internet but uh, get to know in person. So, Hannah, Rebecca, you're awesome. Renee, it was so good to see you again. Robert Vukovic, it was great to see you again. Life on a Plate, uh, Mormon Fool, I got to see again and meet. Um, just so many of you. I, I can't name y'all, sorry. But uh, I had the wonderful opportunity to have a serious interview with several LDS scholars that I am really excited to share with you. We were, I mean, there's some background noises and all, so you might have to listen careful in some respects, but uh, for the most part, I think they did really good talking. I, I was able to interview Daniel C. Peterson, and why on the Shades message boards, so many people on the Shades message boards misunderstand Daniel C. Peterson. I gave him a chance to clarify what he meant in a video interview, which I'm going to put on YouTube here. I also was able to uh, interview Brian Howlett in a very, very nice interview. Uh, and he told me some amazing things, uh, both before I started to record and during recording. And I got to interview Mike Ash. And uh, I got to interview... I got to interview Matt Brown, but he gave me a request. He requested I not post it on the YouTube for right now. And I'm going to honor his request. That's fine. Uh, yeah. In a way, it's too bad because he really has some phenomenal information. But I understand and I'll respect his wishes. That's fine. Thank you for talking to me anyway, Matt. That was very enjoyable. And I was able to uh, interview Romulator, Steve Smoot, the uh, senior in high school that hangs around. And I'll tell you what, Steve, you are fun. I should say, Smoot, you are a hoot. <laughs> it was such a delight to run into you and get to know you better. Uh, I'm proud of you. You are awesome, man. When I grow up, I want to be just like you. <laughs> uh, and then I, I have to thank Cal Mariah and her awesome husband for putting me up. Thank you, you guys. As always, it is such a pleasure. Truly, thank you. I love you guys. You're some of the best friends I have. You're awesome. So, and it was just so good to, uh, oh, to get to talk to Hannah Rebecca and, and uh, get some of her ideas and share some insights with her. And, and I was able to see, oh, I, I met so many of you, so many new faces and all. I can't name you all. I'm sorry. Please don't be offended. But, uh, and I got to interview Blake Osler. Uh, I also got thousands, thousands of new pages of reading material from the Mormon scholarship side. Uh, absolutely amazing. I have really got some fabulous materials to make YouTube videos with, man. We, we, it just, it doesn't stop. It is becoming more and more powerful and all inclusive all the time absolutely delightful and I will be producing many YouTube videos on it and, and Romulator specifically asked me to start doing some more podcasts which I will I, I promise I will I'll start doing some podcasts as well as continue on with this so. anyway it looks like my battery is going low it's going to knock off on me um, enjoy these interviews and I'll be back with some more Hebrew also uh, I'm going to finish off my weekend camping and go relax and enjoy myself Thanks to all of you awesome LDS scholars who allowed me to interview you and giving me such wonderful information. As always, it is such a pleasure to associate with giants like you people. Uh, I saw Matt Roper, got to talk with Matt Roper again. As always, I enjoy seeing him, talking with him, sharing his spirit and testimony and power. Uh, these are just solid quality people. Dan Peterson, once again, thank you so much for all your help. And uh, so, anyway, enjoy the video. I think I'm going to have about eh, 15 tapes on the fair conference. So, and of course, I couldn't include it all. 
I can't include everything that happened. So, you know, I guess you're just going to have to put up with what you had. <laughs> All right, you guys. I'll see you in the next series of videos, won't I? Woohoo! I've got a million billion things to say, I promise. Woo. Blake Osler's new book out on the uh, Mormon thought, his third volume, the best volumes on Mormon theology in print. And uh, we've got a lot to talk about. Blake Osler is for real. They accuse us Mormons of not being able to think or being brain dead. Blake Osler destroys that naive thinking. Uh, if you haven't read Blake Osler, you are out of date on the power of Mormon thought and theology regarding God, his creation, and mankind, and the relationships between God and his creation and us. It is simply breathtaking. And I will do many videos on Blake Osler's materials. It's time to get serious in our understanding. Fabulous stuff. Again, more on the Council of the Gods. Brand new information published just, just this week. And I got one of the fresh hot copies off the press. Thank you, Blake, for showing that to me. I appreciate it. I would have missed it if you wouldn't have told me. So, you guys are awesome. You're always, as always, in my prayers. And I love all of you. I appreciate all of you. I love your friendships. I love sharing information with you. I love sharing time with you. You make life delightful. Truly.